Let's go to the door. We need to talk. Actually, the name's Daniels. This may be a little difficult to absorb, but recent events may make it more plausible. I'm actually from the future. I can't tell you how far. Just that it's a future worth protecting. That's why I'm here now. The aliens we're fighting are called the Nakul, and they're waging a temporal cold war with us. Ah. We're trying to change the timeline cool. here in order to disrupt the future. Understand that I follow a temporal version of the Prime Directive. There's only so much I can reveal to you. Trust that we're doing the right thing here. Time's a factor. We need to stop the Nakul from obtaining the neural parasites. The Nakul ship that brought these invaders is now fighting the USS Ptolemy. Someone must have sent a distress call. Unfortunately, Ptolemy is no match for the Nakul. Neither is your ship, at least not alone. We should eliminate the parasites on the ships you fought earlier. Those crews will help you once their minds are their own again. It's risky, but it's our best shot here. Jetzt machen wir aber aber. Fine work, Captain. You sent those devils back to wherever they came from. I, uh, we do have a wee problem, however. The burst I sent, when combined with the power source, created a feedback pulse. The feedback is creating some kind of. Scott here. The portal's collapsing. We're in for a right bumpy ride. Everyone's aboard. Get us clear before that portal blows. There's doors. I don't think anyone's ever seen a station do that. Yeah, baby. Perhaps not. 
After all, it was a temporal vortex. They may well survive in another time. Well then, it's been quite a day, hasn't it? Neural parasites, time traveling readers. Why, things will seem almost normal once I'm back on the Enterprise. Speaking of, I'm sure one of the ships here can give me a lift back to Ardal if they're parasite free. If Starfleet Command gives you any grief on this, remind them that lives are more valuable than equipment. And you saved a lot of lives today. I apologize for springing all of this on you at the last minute, and I'll explain more as soon as I can. For now, I can tell you that history is unfolding as it should, and that was not the end of K-13. You're building a fine tradition of making the right decisions in crisis situations. In the meantime, don't talk to anyone about the Nakul or their time travel. We can't risk any further corruption of the timeline. Okay. Yeah. Ein Warp 3. Was für eine lächerliche Scheiße. Wieso Warp 3? Warum? Let me get this straight. K-13, an entire space station just disappeared into some type of spatial anomaly? <laughs> <laughs> and I thought some of Kirk's after action reports were a little out there. Starfleet Command won't be pleased with the loss of K-13. Or the people stay Congratulations, safe. Congratulations, Lieutenant. We have a problem at Babel. Cord and Rebels have taken several Federation trade officials hostage. And they're threatening to kill them unless the UFP withdraws from the Cordon sector. I'd like you to work with the negotiation team and try to resolve this peacefully. So, dann gucken wir mal nach. Also, Captain, oh Captain, nee, Schiff, oh Schiff. Captain Was bin denn schon wieder? There's more to this mission than you realize, Captain. Ah, super, ja, ich das Ding übersprungen, diese Arschgeige. Something's not right. I'll explain shortly. Mhm. Mhm. Sei Dank, Mann, gibt's ne Pumpgun. Ne, ne, ja. Mob 5 liegt da gerade? Kann ich mir nicht vorstellen. Es liegt jetzt Mob 5,6. Kann man wohin? Nach Babel reisen. Ach, mach mal schneller. Verdammt, hier kann man kein Transport benutzen. Fuck, 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 fuck. You. Äh. Uh, yeah, baby. Uh, uh, I like it. Schön will ich erreichen. Muss ich wohl noch bleichen. Flieg! Ich 
you love me, Peter. I trust you have trust from me some mind, but got to talk about it. All right, I appreciate your patience. I'm what's known as a temporal agent. It's my job to preserve the timeline. You helped me stop one temporal incursion at K-13. There's been another at Babel, and I could use your help with it. Welcome to the temporal ready room. I use it to monitor the timeline. The Nakul have sent agents to a critical point in time. We believe they disrupted the Babel Conference in 2268 with the USS Enterprise. I want to send you back there to stop them. You'll be sent back to a point shortly before the conference begins. I'm sending one of our best temporal agents along. I believe you've met. Nice to see you again. It's been some time. For me, at least. For you, I see hardly any time has passed at all. It must be strange to see me looking... Uh, older. Once you're on Enterprise, deal with the Nakul and make sure the conference proceeds as planned. You'll have a temporal transponder, which will allow me to communicate with you and bring you back. You'll also have these bioscanners. They're short range, but will detect the Nakul agents nicely. Do the job right, and no one will know we were there. Fascinia. Thank you for coming, Captain. The situation at Babel shouldn't be happening. Something in the past has changed. And... Let's begin by using Enterprise's sensors to look for signs of our time-traveling friends. The computer won't have any details on a Naku, so you'll need to recalibrate the sensor's map. Oh, and one more item to be aware of. Ensign Pavel Chekhov is currently on duty on the bridge, which is why I will be remaining here out of sight. As much as I would like to visit the bridge again, two of me... Let's get to work. I will check with you again after... Boom, baby! Boom, baby! Oh man, schon wieder nicht, Captain Kirk. Nice work. I'm getting some readings from Deck 11, but I can't pinpoint them. Some sort of interference. We'll need to get close and scan. I would speak to you. Halt, das kenne ich doch. Das ist eben eine Reuterung. Leute, die Folge habe ich erst gestern gesehen. How do you vote on the Corridon in Mission? Geil. Echt passend, wie ich die Folgen zur Zeit gucke bei Star Trek. <lacht> 